New at six, new developments in the case of a teenage boy who was murdered with a machete and found buried in Homestead. Dramatic new video obtained by CBS 4 News shows one of the suspects screaming at a Miami-Dade police detective during her interrogation. CBS 4's Peter Dench has the video and he joins us live from the jail in West Miami-Dade. So Peter, what was that suspect saying? Well, Rick, Desiree Strickland says she's innocent. She demands that she be released from custody. She even writes an insulting note about police on a table. Now, on this tape, which is part of the evidence in this case, she is very animated. A Miami-Dade police detective responds to an upset and angry 19-year-old Desiree Strickland. She insists she had nothing to do with the horrific murder in June of 2015 of 17-year-old Jose Amaya Guardado. During her interrogation, she cries out nonstop. Miami-Dade police say Guardado was hacked to death with a machete and found buried in a grave in a wooded area of Homestead. Detectives say Strickland and three other young men conspired to murder Guardado, who they knew was a student at a school for at-risk youth, the Homestead Job Corps. Police say Strickland's boyfriend, Kahim Arbello, was a ringleader and a suspected drug dealer. In an arrest report, Strickland had claimed she walked away during the early part of the attack that was finished by Arbello. Miami-Dade Police Detective Juan Segovia tries to reason with Strickland. You want to talk to me? No. No, I don't want to talk to my dad. Segovia tells her she pushed him while they were walking to the interrogation. Oh, I put my hand on you. I'm you me. I'm she has another concern. You want to send me in a hot yeah. patrol car yes. until I die? You're not going to die. I have asthma. You're not going to die. Okay, if you don't be even here in the air-conditioned room, okay? After Segovia leaves, you see Strickland trying to break free of her handcuffs. The tape also shows Strickland removing screws from an electrical outlet and using them to try to pick open her handcuffs. She also scratches the word on a table, MPD, go to hell. Now, police say that Strickland's three co-defendants have all confessed or all charged with first-degree murder. They say this homicide was triggered by a debt owed to Strickland's boyfriend. We're live in West Miami-Dade. Peter Dench, CBS 4 News. Peter, thank you.